An FSU student survived a motorcycle wreck and a traumatic brain injury, and this weekend he will reach another milestone. James Durham will walk across the stage to receive his college diploma. He says he's literally been to heaven and back to get there. She T-boned me. And I remember the impact. I remember flying off my bike and hitting the pole. James Durham was riding his motorcycle home that night in September 2011 when a car without its blinker on turned left right into him. No one even expected me to wake up. Even the doctors told my family within 24 hours, there's nothing that medicine or doctors can do. You just need to pray. Durham says he spent five weeks in a coma surrounded by loved ones in heaven. I hugged them. I had real conversation. I felt the ground to make sure it was not just a dream. It was all real. And then he woke up. Doctors had removed a chunk of his skull to allow his brain to swell and then later put it back on. Durham spent months at a rehab hospital in Texas. They taught me how to literally walk, talk, eat, function. Durham is now blind in his left eye and has some trouble hearing out of that ear. But a lifelong learning disability, he says, is gone. Within nine months of the crash, Durham was attending classes at community college and then enrolled in FSU. He'll get his degree in communications on Saturday. It's a dream that I never thought would be a possibility. To have him be a graduate in communications in just four short years <laughs> is just, I um, mean, you can't even put words to it. And we're just extremely blessed. And I think James is going to bless some other people. Because of them not only praying for me when I left, but also believing in me since I returned is what makes everything I achieve possible. Durham has created a foundation called TBI One Love to teach people about traumatic brain injuries. His website includes the stories of more than 50 TBI survivors. Durham is hoping that those stories will inspire people to be positive and forge ahead, and most importantly, let them know they are not alone. What an inspiring story. Isn't that incredible? That is unbelievable. And, and he just want, he wants to work with other TBI survivors and help them to achieve their dreams. I'm sure he will, and we wish him the best, and congratulations. Congrats, yeah.